Oh, tell me why this girl was looking me up and down like season's greetings well it's not like early days of january right now it's, we're probably almost entering middle of january but i feel like i'm well rested did enough things that need to be done and i'm ready to start creating content so this is me officially wishing you guys a happy new year you guys we made it we made it so to kick start the new year i was talking about how i'm mostly always out of storage right this new year things are about to change because i stumbled on this hard drive stuff that works with like all kinds of phones with every single gadget you might own it works with them so this is the package i already brought it out this is how it looks this is just a tiny little i got it in 128 gig and you guys the sweetest part about this whole thing is that it comes with this is basically a tripod like an invisible tripod you're just going to stick this to a plain wall put this part on the wall and remove this it sticks to your phone and you can put it on the wall and just do whatever you want to do maybe when you're outside i've been meaning to get this i actually wanted to get it from this popular brand for life and it came as a gift anyways yeah I don't really have much to say. I just look really nice and I wanted to show you guys. <laughs> Hey guys, I don't know if this light is shitty, but um, I just finished getting ready. I'm so excited for today. I'm going to a content studio. I'm waiting for my driver right now, but I just want to tap in fingers crossed that I actually get everything I want to do done. I just got back. I literally had to film the ending part of the video. I had to go. Yet yeah, the one I went out to do, I had to come back home to film the end part. I have some things to say. You know what i'm just going to start this up by saying if you ever book a content studio like don't have so much high expectations first of all i got there quite early because my time was 10 to 11 so i got there as a like 9 47 ish so i get there and i'm like at the door and they say can you give us like a few minutes you're gonna have to stand outside because we're arranging or whatever it is they're doing i'm like okay this girl leaves me and goes up there no problem i did not get in until like 9 57 or something like that so i get in i have to wait till my time when i got in i was still at the reception i had to wait before i could even enter into the studio so now i've gotten into the studio i asked for lights they said it's just one tripod and one light fine because i already asked them before i even went but then the light that they gave me was not really giving me what i wanted so i was like can i get another light they said fine then he went and brought lead 219 or 300 those of you that know lead lights you know how small that particular lead light is he brought that and said i should pay 5k for it 
this light is not even all that bright and before i can get i mean i could make it work but before i would get the right angle where that light would do what i want it to do i don't have the time time is not on my side even when i was done to the I could not even order my bolts inside. As soon as I finished, they told me to go and wait outside for my bolts. I understand that it works with time, but still, like, come on now. Come on. Like, relax. It's not that deep. Nobody was even there. No one was there as at the time I was done. Ready to, you know, like, maybe 11 to 12. Because if they were there, I'm sure they would be around by then. They kicked me out. Like, get the fuck out advice for you if you're actually going there just like book four hours or like two hours if you're going to book one hour just know that like you're only going to do maybe one look maybe you just want to take only pictures or you want to make a reel it's going to be only one look you can do you can't do every single thing i was taking my pictures and the girl tell me why this girl was looking me up and down like smacking me with her eyes me i'm just there like i don't understand overall i was just really not as comfortable as i felt i would i booked you guys because i'm trying to get away from all the restaurants people wahala and now i'm here i'm not comfortable enough because you're over there looking at me funny and the other guy there's that, that guy was actually helpful to some extent maybe when the light goes off he will try and help me turn it on but Every single move I made, it, it felt like they were jumping out of corners just to like, like I'm going to move with something. I'm not running away. You're going to be here when I leave. Nothing is going to happen. Or maybe it's the fit that I wore that was making the girl look at me like that. But then you work in a fucking content studio. This should not be new to you. If this is this is something that should be like an everyday thing to you. So why are you even saying like, anyways. I'm about to take off my makeup. Ooh, whole new girl. I just feel like I had higher expectations and it wasn't met point blank period. <laughs> it was not. I know I'm going to start looking crazy now. <laughs> I wanted to film my new year resolutions earlier this year, but um, the planning of the video, it could not happen. But I want to touch upon it a little soon. Part of my new year resolutions is I would like to start posting longer vlogs. I'm actually going to start with this. I feel like the person I am offline, like with my friends, is not the person I am on YouTube. I want to be talking to you guys like I'm talking to my friends, you know? Like, I want us to be talking, I want us to be vibing. Do you get? So yeah, I'm trying to achieve that and I know that for me to do that, I'm going to need longer vlogs. That's why I got that flash drive. I don't even want to see this next one because <laughs> some people will kick me out like, get out. What? How many times have you been saying this? But I'll say it anyways. I would like to also be more consistent. <laughs> consistent in the sense that like, you know, I'm not just always post today, run off to like probably next month maybe like one video a week from my lips to god's ears i'm trying my best bro if you're wondering what i'm using i'm using makeup remover oil i know it will happen it's going to be a big deal for me when it happens though but i know it will the makeup is off what you gotta say huh i'm going to go and wash off my face then i'll come and talk normally all right i just changed into this my house shirt and washed off the makeup Look at that glow. Look at that glow. I know I'm always wearing this shirt in my videos, but don't judge me like that, girl. We all have that one shirt. So I'm going to wait for my face to air dry, then I'm gonna use um my face mask. I have this face mask I wanna use. Another thing I'm trying to work on is maturing on like a deeper level. You know, the way I react to situations mentally spiritually much more closer to god every ramifications i just want to be that calm girl that's just like in a bag minding her business and making it big period i've been wanting to join the gym for like the longest now but i just keep procrastinating anyways it's going to happen this year read more books you guys i used to read a lot when i was in uni 
I used all the novels they would give us. I would read every single thing. But now, it's just not coming naturally anymore. And I would love to continue that habit. I would also like to try new things. Get out of my comfort zone. You know, all that good jazz. Just a healthier lifestyle, basically. 2024 will be our year by God's grace. Okay, it's kind of difficult to talk with this. I'm about to eat my food, my little food, and lay up, try to edit some videos. That's mostly a lie because I'll probably end up watching a movie. I don't know if this is the end of this vlog, but if it's not, you will not see this part. But if it is, you guys, thank you for rocking with me, and I'll catch you in my next video. Bye.